I'm back with another car chat. I have not done a car chat in uh, forever. And I don't know why. I just, I don't know. I just haven't done one. So back with another car chat. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you have not. I try to do these every so often. Let me move my little phone thing. I try to do these every so often when I find good topics. I feel like social media be giving me my best stuff. Like, I be looking at people's posts and like, huh? What? What, what are we talking about here? Why are we doing this? But I came across another good one and basically I don't know if this was a real post if it was a meme or what but I'm more so talking about the reaction that it got from certain people underneath the post and also the person who posted this meme or post or whatever so there was basically a photo on Instagram with a woman with like she looked like she had just had a baby she had like like her stomach was like like saggy skin or whatever and um it just it looked like somebody who might have just had a baby and so the caption read um i can't remember if it was my wife or my girlfriend but either way what i'm about to say is just wrong but my wife had a baby 12 weeks ago and she lost all the baby weight but still has that saggy skin around her stomach i offered for her to get surgery to correct that but she refused am i wrong for not being attracted to her anymore or not wanting to be sexually intimate with her anymore because she has you know her body's changed basically so okay obviously if that's a real post a man wrote that clearly and so i was like you know what as wrong as wrong as that is you know what let me break it down before i even go into my opinion let's break it down one are you wrong for not being attracted to, to her i can't say anybody's wrong for not being attracted to anyone you like what you like however i do feel like if you really love that person and they just had your baby 12 weeks ago like i don't feel like the attraction would change much just in my mind and maybe i'm wrong but if somebody just had your baby 12 weeks ago i don't feel like you would be like most people would be like oh my god they have some you know a little bit of loose skin from pushing out a whole human out of their vagina like i, I don't feel like anyone would be bothered by that sorry i got a phone call so yeah i don't feel like anyone would be super like i'm just not attracted to you at all after 12 weeks of you having a baby and having some new skin but if they are i can't fault you for not being attracted to something i mean it's we're attracted to what we're attracted to but keeping that going he also said he offered her surgery if you ever suggest surgery if mark would to ever suggest surgery for me the only type of surgery he better ever suggest is if my health and my life is in danger. Like, they like, oh, girl, if you don't lose a certain amount of weight, like, really fast, your life is in danger. Like, you're going to die. That's the only type of surgery, some gastric bypass, that he better ever, ever suggest for me. Okay? I mean, one, I feel like for you to even suggest any type of surgery after someone just had a baby 12 weeks ago for you to suggest that i lay on a table and let somebody cut me open after i just had a baby 12 weeks ago tells me that you really don't care about me whatsoever that that's what that tells me that you don't love me and that you don't care about me whatsoever so that's just breaking down the post now let's break down the person's response who made this post this was a female who has had multiple children and she said that she does not think that this man is wrong does not think this man is wrong and and why would we get so offended when <laughs> he offered a solution to the problem and i was appalled i was upset after seeing that and i'm like for like as a man 
a man will never understand what it's like to have a baby they just won't they won't understand the mental changes that you go through the physical changes that you go through they won't understand they just won't understand that technically you're recovered if you just have a vaginal birth technically you're recovered after six weeks you're cleared to go back to work you have a c-section technically if everything went well you're recovered after eight weeks and you're free to go back to work that's that's what they see and in their minds everything is right after those time periods right everything's back to normal now as a woman who's had children I feel like you know that that is completely not the case in my mind I feel like it takes at least at least a year to get yourself back to normal and in my case I like it's, I feel like it took me so much longer because I had babies back to back. Like my, you all know, girls 13 months apart. I had them back to back. My one baby was five months. I found out I was pregnant again. That was crazy. So it took me, in my case, I feel like even longer. But I feel like it takes at minimum a year to get yourself together. So for you to suggest only a couple, I mean, honestly, this is at 12 weeks. That's only a few weeks after I'm cleared to do anything, to work out, to go back to work, to do anything. And you're suggesting that I go get myself cut open? For a woman to suggest that that is an okay solution, for a woman to suggest that another woman should go get surgery because her man asked her to, it, <laughs> I was I was so I didn't understand I was so offended that is crazy to me and if you guys have a difference of opinion or the same opinion please let me know down below if I'm tripping but I was so disgusted with that post that we would ever suggest to another woman that this man offered a good solution and that's what she should go with I was I was appalled I could not believe that that was a woman who's had children by the way speaking this way now y'all know me clearly I'm married and I I wholeheartedly believe that you should keep yourself up for your man I feel like you should I mean if your man met you at 120 pounds I feel like you should try to stay as close to that 120 pounds as possible you should try to keep your hair done your nails done if that's what you're into you should just try to keep yourself looking nice for your mate I wholeheartedly wholeheartedly believe that I also know that life changes happen that we all go gain a little weight you was 120 pounds at 20 you're not gonna be 120 pounds probably at 40 like that's just what it is but I do feel like you need to keep yourself up for your man now at no time at no time do I feel like you need to be going under the knife for somebody else's expectations of you at no time um, if, if you want to lose weight, if your man wants you to lose weight, a good way for him to suggest it would be, hey baby, let's go work out together. Hey baby, I'm going to start cooking more because I want us to be healthy, so I'm going to start cooking, you know, better meals. Instead of just saying, oh, you need to eat better or you need to do this. He needs to be a part of the solution too. And I'm not, I mean, obviously it's you that gained the weight maybe, but if, if your man wants to suggest that you lose weight, I suggest that that's the way he does it. Not telling you to get go under the knife for certain like I, I think that's I was so upset I can't even collect my thoughts I was so upset when I saw that and it just really told me what type of mind state that that person was in as well as some of the people in the comments because most of the comments now most of the comments disagreed with her male female most of them were like girl you lost your damn mind but there were some women and a couple it was a couple guys but more women in the comments saying that like agreeing with her and going you know you're right I do agree he did offer a solution and she turned it down like that's not a solution you telling me to get surgery after I've just had a baby or period is not a solution to that problem at all at all but maybe I'm crazy Y'all tell me what y'all think about this situation, and I hope it all made sense, but I was so angry about this. Like I said, I can't even collect my thoughts correctly because I was just so angry and beyond disgusted, again, that another woman would encourage, especially with all these impressionable minds on social media. I feel like there's so many, there are so many women that are doing this and getting ass shots and 
and all of that stuff because they want to look better to men not they want to look better for themselves but they want to look better to men to their men they want their men to be attracted to them and baby if you only gonna be attracted to me if i get my boobs done or my ass done and we know we shouldn't be together if that's the only way you're gonna be attracted to me if you're only gonna be attracted to me if i'm 120 pounds we shouldn't be together now again i fully believe you need to keep yourself attractive for your man or your woman whatever i fully believe you need to keep yourself up however if you're only attracted to me because i look one type of way you ain't for me you're not for me and that's then that's just that but comment down below and let me know what y'all think about that situation i as you can see i'm very passionate about that let me know what y'all think am i crazy do y'all feel the same way as this person i would just love to know what you think i would also love to get some males commenting because i, I just want to see what y'all think my husband thought it was crazy as well mark was like what <laughs> like he was just as appalled as i was so um i would definitely love to hear from some males but that is the end of this video i will see you guys later thank you so much for watching and listening to me rant and i'll talk to you guys in the next one bye